and the teams uh, for today's game a few casualties in both sides you can see the changes there Jay Surya is still playing Upul Tharanga coming in for Saurav Ganguly otherwise uh, pretty much the same side just at the bottom Mohammad Rafiq as well as uh, Murtaza getting another game for Africa Pat Simcox as we run us through Africa Pat <laughs> well good afternoon Robbie yeah they all got to play there's only 11 players left Alvi Morkel injured the international the batsman uh, what a catch! Clear across to his right. The unlucky batsman to be dismissed is Sebag. Have a look at this. They say he's as good as they get in South Africa, and he always fills in the slips for South Africa, so that tells you why. We're in to see where he's gone for a danger man. This could be out, straight down the throat of the man's square leg. Well, he chanced his arm. He'd be disappointed, will Jay Surya? Did not have to move more than a meter. Enjoy for the young bowler. So the big. That is a stunner, absolute stunner. We are seeing some fantastic catches here at uh, Chennai. Turf, it was hit so hard. Take a look at this. Well, he was literally flying in the air. Just take a look at this catch. A.B. de Villiers, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. That should have been four. Balls. Oh, that's in the air and that's got to go. That is wicket number four. And it is needless again. Suddenly you get the feeling that they're really not in the contest as they should be. Very. Yes, he was looking to clear the field. And I think that's a difference in the surface. The ball, had it come on well enough onto the bat, would have cleared Dipana at mid on. But it's not come of the middle of the bat, so Angondo is having a bit of a purple patch here. Hi, I'm Mahala Jawadana, 30 years old, right hand batsman. 30 years old, Jayawardana coming in with his side 51 for 4. Does he have clear in his mind in, in Newlands last year? Turn his fortunes around for a while. Got him! Dragged it on! Alton Tigumbura has got a wicket. The Asian 11 have lost it. He's loosening himself. And I'm wondering if that bat that's got a, a distinct turn to inside is partly to blame of that. Inside, onto the stumps. And that's a big wicket right now. 72 for 5 as Yuvraj departs for 31. Here's Dhoni. Mahendra Singh Dhoni. Look at those numbers. They're good numbers. Fantastic numbers. Beautiful shot. Buffet ball. Help yourself. To look at the buildings. The building blocks and up. Oh, he really does play the shot well. We've seen him play one of these in every inning so far. And he's swiveling while playing the pull shot, but his balance is so good. Yes, and the sound of the ball. It's late September. What a good shot. Straight out of uh, the subcontinent style. You'll find a lot of risky shots. Sri Lankans, Pakistanis, Indians. This is a beauty. Pulled very impressively. That's a good shot. That's fine. That'll get it for... In the end that he hit a few boundaries. He's going to get a boundary there. He has smashed that. Short from Johan Bota. And he goes quickly onto the back foot. And he gets it in the gap. It had a little juice in it. Or this afternoon at the start. Oh, that was close. Inside edging it for four. It was perilous.
two comfortably taken did he drop it Buddha thinks so Mark Thatcher doesn't smart cricket cheeky shot for four but he knew exactly what he was doing. It was intentional. Just use the shoe. He's going to have the power that he had when he came in, though. Oh, that's neat. That is such a little death touch. Played some match winning innings. Once again, the placement superb. Now there's an example of that again. This is superb batting by Jay Wadana. Buddha was going at four and over. Yes, Tony is ready to entertain. And that's into the stands easily. This is what they from Jay Warden as well. For eight overs. He's releasing some pressure here. That's four more. What a powerful shot. For board, 15, 20 runs could be added. And that's if you're back quickly. Quiet individual just goes about his business. One bounce into the boundary. Very quickly, this partnership is worth 150. And a big over this for the Asian level. It's 223 for five. Then run away as well, though I think that's wise. More likely wide. Scarlet wide. We've seen far too many very good cricketers start off as pure cricketers. We only worry about it if he gets out for 97. Well, having said that, he's probably also obsessed with numbers. We talk about that. That's a better shot. And that will get him runs too. Now, Peter and Gondo has given up the chase very quickly and put that down to the weather. And from his numbers that you see, his statistics. Oh, goodness. That's going to go for four. When he has a go, he has a go. And he smashed that. They're expectant, the crowd as well. They want him to go ahead and have a go. Party time. Where do you want me to do it next? I think I'll go long on. It's a bit of a bloodbath here. Oh, goodness. Get ready, folks, at home. Oh, not quite that time, but it gets him four. Gets him another four. All right, 250 comes up. Partnership is worth 178. The highest partnership at his ground. And draws it here. Yes. Getting in on the act. Mahela Jaya Wardena. 255 for five. It's gone a long, long way. It's a very long way, that six from Mahela Jaya Wardena. Partnership comes up. There's a few landmarks on the corner here. We've got 203 and 21 overs. Now 99. 100 to Mahila Jayavardhana. Well played. 10th one day international 100. For this captain and a lot of joy to a lot of people here. Demanding conditions. Not the toughest of attacks but very demanding conditions. 100 from 100. The situation dictated that he play a captain's knock. Can describe it as such. It's been fantastic to watch. Charging back for a second, and he'll get it. Mahindra Singh Dhoni gets a hundred as well, and the crowd is overjoyed as the leader, all of us. 
What a good innings. 72 for 5 when he came out to bat. He put on 208. And he'll be proud of his effort, Mahindra Singh Dhoni. Yes, his third hundred. It's not often he gets opportunities to get to a hundred. Kukul Taranga has come out as a runner for Jai Vardhana. A fartless. A fartless in the distance. What a good player. What a good bat. Johan Botha admonishes himself. Yes, there's something he could have done better. It's pretty straight, that ball. Gives himself room. Ever so slightly does that and plays inside out for six. Straight to the man down at backward point. Yuan Boda is there, so that's the end of Maila Jayabardana. And he'll go back and uh, be looking to beat that man at backward point. Didn't that time. But it's a job well done that comes to an end. Here it is again. Digs it out, not moving too freely. And on the ball, straight to Johan Bota. Morkel gets away. He can hit the ball a long way as well. Just seemed to be favouring one foot as he came out to bat. And I hope uh, that was just a, a man already batting in demanding conditions. Six. Don't say it so nonchalantly. What a shot. Goodness me. It, a full toss. The question would be whether it was above the waist. But to put it away as he has done was absolutely brilliant from Dhoni. Just six. It would be very strange if he was called up for bowling above waist high if the batsman dismissed it in that manner. But I guess a rule is a rule. It's got to be implemented. And that's gone as well. There are no droplets of water here. There's only burst pipes. And Dippin out put a limp left hand out to it. There we go. Little left hand. The legs not quite having the energy and he's been put back in, put inside the circle. Almost slow, 34 balls by comparison, the last 50. It's a miscue. There's a man coming underneath it. <laughs> Couldn't have back bothered. Miscues are going for six here. And 308 for six. And we're seeing balls flying off to all parts. Yes, it's a full toss. It should go for runs bats and I saw the size of the edge that's gone up high as well but there's a fielder underneath it and he takes the catch Moni Mokal in there and he completes a good one so Mashavi Murtaza has gone resigned look on the face of Elton Chigumbura he's got a wicket he's happy to have got a wicket but could quite easily have been another one out into the crowd a good catch that oh, Moni Mokal Brief say at the wicket for Mashrafi Mortaza. Asia 11, 309 for 7. He's coming because uh, Mashrafi Mortaza has just got a leading edge to both AB de Villiers. They'll be telling my bowlers, come on guys, get a move on here. That didn't matter, did it? Not at all. Didn't matter at all. Could do with every minute possible. Let's get this over quick, quickly. Never mind, I wanted to have dinner. Hey, can I get a bite here? Notice you've got a plate next to you. Ball him! Good bowling by Moni Morkel, he's still running in hard. And that's the done. He wasn't on target with the ball that went for four, but no such trouble that time. Harvajan didn't want anything to do with it, it was quick. 315 for eight. Some of you are wondering why he said 37 over. Some of us in the subcontinent learn to counter ages. Tony is in strike. Let's see what we get here. What a great beginning. First ball out of the ground. Six number five for Mahinder Singh Dhoni. He just keeps going. 
and deposited over square leg. Do that nine times out of ten, Dhoni. 129 not out. All right, Kemp's getting somebody in. I thought he might send everyone out uh, in the streets outside the stadium. Some maybe by the old Buckingham Canal, is it called? The Coombe River, down the side. Rafik is 37 over. Straight three balls. There's another big one. Four more. You send somebody back and then you do this. It's justified. It seems like someone's at the receiving end of a big first serve, doesn't it? Just big ones pounding away. Yeah, at the circle on the onside at all. I don't think that matters to anybody. Where is he going to go? Another four. How cheeky and how clever. This fine for the fine leg. What's he gonna do now? It's probably gonna. Where's this one going? Not too far. Tony is charging down. He wants a second, and Mohammed Rafiq will have to run on this occasion. So he's hopped the strike, but he's uh, sent the ball to long corners. That's the end then. 331 for eight from 50 overs. At a halfway mark, there are 101. The second 25 have produced 230 runs. It boggles the mind, doesn't it? Two for 77 to Chigumbara. And the few people that have turned up here at the Chidamburam Stadium have got their money. I can tell all the kids in the neighborhood. We were there when Tony played in innings like that. There's a look at the scorecard and the top order. Well, they're blown away. Five down in no time. And then from then on, at the end, 139 of 97. The partnerships, well, only one to speak of, really. 218 of just 178 balls. And he continued to smash it. Well, the bowling figures aren't going to look pretty, but some of them are very good. Morne Mokel, 3 for 50, and Peter Ngondo, 3 for 35. So the damage came elsewhere. I thought Bota was good too, none for 49. But Tikolo, 4 of us, none for 59. Sibanda, 2 of us, none for 24. De Villiers 2 was none for 20.